So uh, then and now, this um, for the unit seven, we are going here to talk about present uh, past symbol, regular verbs, irregular verbs, silent letters, and special occasions. Uh, when we were or when uh, were you grandparents and great grandparents born? Where were they born? Do you know all their names? What were their jobs? If you know, tell the class. When I was young, past simple regular verbs. Read and listen to Matty Smith, Life Now, complete text with verbs you hear. Matty Smith in 90, is 19 uh, or 91 years old. She was uh, alone or she lived alone in uh, Atlanta, Georgia. She uh, spent her day at or started her day at 7.30. First, uh, she um, had a bath, next she cleaned the house, and then she went outside on her uh, vernad and uh, dash about her past life and tell about her past life, then she uh, say poems about it, okay? This is Matty Smith. Matty was never at school. لم تكن أبدا في المدرسة. She lived with her mother, تعيش مع والدتها, and uh, four sisters, وأربعة إخوة. Uh, so we can say, um, she started work when she was eight. بدأت بالعمل عندما كان عمرها uh, ثمانية أعوام. And also, um, <coughs> She worked in the cotton fields تعمل في حقول القطن from 6 in the morning to 10 at night من السادسة صباحا وحتى العاشرة مساء She couldn't read or write but she could think لم تستطع قراءة وكتابة ولكنها تستطيع التفكير She created <coughs> poems in her head وكانت تخترع uh, القصائد في مخيلتها okay. فإذا هذه هي um, Matty or Matty Smith. Okay. Here we have read and listen to text B about Matty. Life is a long grammar spot. Find examples of the past. Is and can end text B. Complete the sentences with I live in the correct form. Now she lives alone or she uh, lives alone. But when she was a child, she was living with her mother and sister. What is the past form of these verbs? Listen and practice saying them. Look, locked, work, worked, love, loved, learn, learned, earn, earned, marry, married, die, died, hate, hated, want, wanted. Okay, with adding ed. Read and listen to Matty talking about her past life. Complete the text. اقرأ واستمع ثم اكمل الجمل. Um, so I was from 6 in the morning until 10 at night, 16 hours in the cotton field. And I only earned $2 a day. I sure that, um, I sure liked or loved that job, but I, uh, think the poems in my head. I really wanted to learn to read and write when I was 16. I was uh, Hubbard and uh, son, I was married, uh, married Hubbard, and so on. There were six children, five sons, then one daughter, Lily Hubbard. Hubbard was just before she was born, uh, that was 65 uh, years ago. So I <coughs> dash after my family, I locked after my family alone. There was no time for learning, but my children, they all learned to read and write. <coughs> that was important to me, or to me. And when did I learn to read and write? I didn't learn until I was 86. And now I have <coughs> three books of poems. إذن كانت يعني حياتها مليئة بالمتاعب والمشاق وبدأت العمل أو بدأت القراءة والكتابة تعلم الكتابة والقراءة في عمر السادس الستة وثمانين عام يعني لديها كان إرادة قوية جدا جدا على تعلم القراءة والكتابة في عمر الستة وثمانين ف 
هنا يجب أن نوصل رسالة إيجابية أن الإنسان مهما بلغ من العمر يجب أن يتعلم حتى وإن كان عمره في التسعين والثمانين والمئة لأنه سبحان الله من سلك طريقا يبتغي فيه علما سهر الله به أو له طريقا إلى الجنة فالعلم لا يعرف وقت ولا يعرف مكان ولا يعرف عمر ولا أي شيء إطلاقا هذه نصيحة مني لكم جميعا يجب علينا دائما أن نتعلم وأن نستفيد وأن ننهل من العلوم والمعارف حتى نصل إلى مرحلة الإشباع وأنا متأكد وأجزم أننا لن نصل إلى مرحلة الإشباع مهما بلغت ثقافتنا وعلومنا Grammar spot Find a question and a negative in the last part of the text about merit Look at these questions where does she live now? She lives uh, now alone. And where did she live in 1950 with her family? Did is the past of do. And does we use did to form a question in the past symbol and negative. Uh, so, by the way, if you remember past symbol tense, uh, we use did with all the pronouns with negative and question form of the sentence. Okay, guys? يعني كلمة ديد نستخدمها دائما نحن مع السؤال والنفي في حالة زمن الماضي بسيط حصرا أما دو داز هي عبارة عن الحاضر لمن لدد والأصل أو المصدر منها هو دو أوكي Complete the questions about Matty When did she start work? Where did she get married? Who did she marry with? How many hours did she work? How much did she earn? Who did she uh, talk and when did Harvard die? When did she learn to read? Okay, practice talking about you. Complete the sentences with that. Was or where? Where were you born? Where were your mother born? Uh, where was <coughs> your mother born? When? Where you start school and when? Uh, where you learn to read and write who was your first teacher what was your favorite subject and where were you lived now uh, when you uh, were a child um, dash you live in a house or a flat where you live stand up and ask two questions about that okay here we have look at the last of irregular verbs on page 142 write the past simple form of the verbs in the box which verb isn't irregular have had leave left when won begin begun get got lose lost come came study studied buy bought go went become became meet met do dead so only study as um regular verb okay uh, listen and repeat the past simple forms how old were you in 2000 Siamon was 24 listen to him and complete the sentences what did you or what did Siamon do <clears throat> he was at school in 1994 he went to university where he was um, graphic design then in 1995, he uh, had a job with uh, a Saatchi and Saatchi, an advertising agency in London. <coughs> he were his, um, he married, married his girlfriend Zoe in 1998, and the next year they had a flat together. What happened in the world? Tony Blair. Sport. Um, I'm sorry about that. So, sport. France was the World Cup in 19... or won the World Cup in 1989. Brazil lost the World Cup. Politics. Tony Blair was the Britain's Prime Minister in 1997. Bill Clinton uh, won uh, a lot of problems or made a lot of problems in his last years. Uh, in the White House, 11 countries in Europe, uh, but not Britain where to use the euro in 1999 <clears throat> famous people princess diana was um, drive uh, was in a car crash in paris in 1997 millions of people were to london for her funeral 
last again or listen again and check uh, as I said because we don't have listening we cannot complete uh, also practice when did uh, it happen work in a small groups what important dates in the 20th century can you remember uh, what happened in the world and what happened in your country make a list of events then make questions to ask the other groups what did the first world uh, war begin and متى بدأت الحرب العالمية الأولى وانتهت when did the first person walk on the moon متى مشى أول شخص على سطح القمر what did you do look at the uh, at these phrases last night last Monday week month year yesterday morning afternoon evening so <coughs> work with a partner ask and answer questions with when did you last ask another questions for more information when did you last have a holiday last August when did you go to Spain <coughs> last uh, for example or where did you go to Spain have a holiday see a video go shopping give someone a kiss take a photograph go to party lose something write a letter get a present have a dinner and restaurant okay so here we have uh, Clinton Yukio had a holiday last August and she went to Italy check it the correct sentences he bought uh, some new shoes he bought some new shoes so he bought where did you go yesterday where we, you went yesterday where did you go yesterday you uh, see Jane last week or did you see Jane last week did you okay uh, Ivan did she go, uh, get the job <clears throat> did she go or got the job did she get okay I went out yesterday evening I went out last evening yesterday evening both of them are correct he studied French at university he studied French at university number one studied without why what had you uh, for breakfast what did you have for breakfast number B I was in New York the last week I was in New York last week okay guys so uh, these are uh, reading and speaking two famous uh, first translate these words now uh, grocer slaves politician twins windows enters agree bump grow fight own resign survive okay Look at the photographs and uh, complete these sentences. George uh, Weston was the first was the first grocer. Uh, Margaret teacher was the first uh, resign. And also here we have work in two groups. Know about these people. Group A, read about uh, George Weston. Group B, read about Margaret Teacher. Are the sentences true or false about your person? Correct the false sentences. He or she came from a rich family. He or she loved being a politician. He or she worked hard. He, she had a lot of other interests. Okay, guys. So, by the way, we have two famous uh, first. Gorg, uh, Georgiou uh, Westinghon, uh, 1732 1799. Uh, his life and his later life, we are going to read it and answer the question. Um, here we can say he was the first president of the United States, he became president in 1789, eight years after the American War of Independence. كان أول رئيس للولايات المتحدة الأمريكية وأصبح رئيسا في عام 1789 لمدة ثمان أعوام بعد الحرب العالمية بعد الحرب التي اندلعت في أمريكا. His early life حياته المبكرة. George was born in uh, Virginia. His family owned a big farm and uh, had slaves. Uh, George didn't have much education during his life. He had three jobs. He was uh, a farmer, a soldier, and a politician. He loved the life of a farmer. He grew uh, tobacco and owned hours or horses. فإذن كان حي... كان يعيش مع عائلته وكان لديه مزرعة كبيرة جدا. Uh, كان دائما يحب uh, العلم. Uh, 
وخلال حياته امتلك ثلاث وظائف كان مزارع وجندي وسياسي وهو يحب الحياة الزراعية لذلك زرع التوباكو اللي هو الدخان أو الشيء الذي يسمى ب الشيء الخاص بالسيجارت يعني بالسجائر تمام ما يسمى بالتمباك تقريبا ايضا هي اونتد هورسز كان لديه احصنه هي وركت هارد عمل بجد بس هي اولسو لايك دانسينج اند جوينج تو ذا ثيتر ولكن ايضا يحب الرقص والذهاب الى السينما او المسارح ان 15 50 ان 1759 في 1759 هي مارد او ويدو كولد مارثا كوستس They were happy together, but they didn't have any children. كانوا سعيدين ولكن دون أطفال. His later life, في حياته المتأخرة, he was a commander in chief of the army and fought the British in the War of Independence. في حياته الأخرى كان commander ضابط كوماندوز في الجيش الأمريكي وقاتل البريطانيين في حرب الانفصال. When the war ended in 18 in 1781, he was happy to go back to the farm, but his country wanted him to be president. Okay. طبعا عندما انتهت الحرب في 1781 كان سعيدا للذهاب مرة أخرى إلى المزرعة ولكن الدولة قررت أنه يصبح رئيس لأمريكا. Finally, in 1789, he became a president and gave his name to the new capital city. He started the building of the White House. But he never lived in it. <coughs> By 1797, he was tired of politics. He went back to his farm and died there two years later. وفي عام 1989 تسلم الرئاسة وبنى البيت الأبيض ولكن لم يسكن فيه أبدا. ثم انتقل في 1779 تعب من السياسة وعاد ثانية إلى مزرعته ومات فيها بعد عامين. أما بالنسبة لمارغريت ثيتشر 1925، she was the first woman prime minister in Europe. she became prime minister of Britain or Britain in 1979. طبعاً مارغريت أول رئيسة وزراء يعني في أوروبا في عام 1979. she was born above a shop in the small English town of Grantham. Her father, Alfred Roberts, was a grocer. He worked very hard <coughs> for little money. Margaret also worked hard, and she went to Oxford University where she studied. إذا ولدت في بيت فوق محل صغير في بلدة Grantham في إنجلترا. والدها كان بقالا تمام وكان يعمل بشكل صعب جدا حتى يأخذ القليل من المال. مارغريت انتقلت عملت ايضا بجد وانتقلت الى جامعه اكسفورد لتكمل تعليمها هناك. She studied chemistry in 1951. She married Dennis Thatcher, a rich businessman. وفي 1951 تزوجت ب Dennis Thatcher اللي هو رجل اعمال غني جدا في بريطانيا. They had twins, a girl and a boy. وكان لديهم توأم طفل وطفله. Uh, the love of her life was politics. حبها في الحياة كان السياسة. She didn't have much time for other interests. لم يكن لديها وقت آخر لأي اهتمامات. She said she only needed four hours sleep a night. وكانت تنام أربع ساعات فقط في الليلة. أما حياتها الأخرى, she became a politician in 1959. في عام 1959 أصبحت سياسية وقائدة للبرلمان. Uh, in 1979 and uh, prime minister of Britain for four years after that she had a strong uh, personality a lot of people were afraid of her بعد اربع سنوات كانت شخصيته قوي جدا وكان الناس يخافون منها and she was called the iron lady وكانت تسمى المراه الحديديه in 1984 uh, Irish terrorist bombed her hotel But she survived. She was prime minister for 11 years. وفي عام 1984 إرهابي إيرلندي فجر الأوتيل الخاص بها ولكنها نجت وبقت رئيسة وزراء لمدة 11 عام. She finally resigned in 1990. في عام 1990 استقالت. But she didn't want to. ولكن لم كانت تريد ذلك. And she was tears or in tears when she left 
10 داونينج ستريت وكانت تبكي بحرقه عندما غادرت شارع العاشر في بريطانيا فاذا هذا هو النص للوحده السابعه وان شاء الله تعالى فوكابولري اندرونسيشن وي تيك ات ان انذر فيديو